All right, so we got a little bit of a gopher problem here, or a mole problem, as you can see. Uh, it's just a giant mound of dirt here that I've been trying to trap this guy. Um, I used a black box, and usually it works pretty good, but uh, not successful this time. I've been guessing the wrong way of which way he's coming, so I'm going to set a couple traps. First, I got to dig all this dirt out of this um, uh, hole here and expose the uh, tunnel, so we're going to do that real quick. All right, here's this little guy, and uh, this thing worked pretty amazing, so I'm going to show you how to set this one. Get it through there. Oops. Trying to get my middle, middle one through the middle so I can set in the trap there. There we go, okay. So that's through there. Now, I want to press this middle part down like that. Okay. Now, got a plunger here and that goes through there. So, when I'm setting it, I want it kind of in there pretty far just so it doesn't trigger. Make sure you keep your fingers clear of this too. Alright, so, I got a hole in right down there. So, what we're going to do is we're gonna dig down a little bit. We're gonna kind of bury this one, so you see the little claws are sticking up there. So I'm just kind of, I'm gonna dig it down into the dirt a little bit, under the run. All right, there we go. That, and then backfill over that with some dirt, just so that that part's not really exposed, right? Your, uh, everything's covered right here. Oh, well, almost got myself. That would have been pretty cool. So, anyways, you see how I did that. I shouldn't have done that that easily. Now let's try this again here. Get it all packed in there. All right, get my. Dirt on there. Hopefully, you should hold it in place. Hold that spoon down there so it doesn't snap on my hand. Okay, so you kind of want to pack it down. So, all you have is just, just the dirt run going to your, your uh, trigger right here. And then, you just want to set this trigger so you just just barely on there. So just the slightest bit of dirt pushing into that is gonna set that off. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys what that looks like real quick here. Let's get a little bit of a close up here. Okay, so I covered the dirt and packed it down kind of over the top so when he comes along you should just push on that. I didn't see another hole on this side so hopefully he's over there. He's been pretty active in this tunnel so it's like his main thing. So when he pushes the dirt along there and hits that, as you can see it's just barely, it's just barely on there so just the slightest little push is going to set that off. And hopefully we'll catch ourselves a gopher or something. So, Alright my friends, thanks for watching this video and uh, we'll be back. That's how you set a gopher trap. Now, one quick other thing. So, I have a couple of them. And if you have a, if you have a run where there's a hole on the other side too, you set another trap going the opposite direction in the same, the same way. And I'm going to leave, if I can find some of these on Amazon, I'll leave a link in the description below and you guys can uh, get some of these. These things work pretty awesome if you set them right. So, hi my friends, thanks for watching.